Oh, and, uh, <laughs> no, no, give it back. Give, give what back? Sorry, I, I, I can't hear you. the windows. Have a nice day, officer. Hey, hey. I'd never do that. That's very dangerous. You could run over a small child. Give me back my pen, sir. What pen? No, squeeze the gap. Oh shit. And he just flipped about three times end over end. I was definitely doing the speed limit. Okay, okay I was definitely doing the speed limit. <laughs> okay. I'll buy you fries. Free fries and pizza and donuts and Right, while I'm waiting for uh, Fred to find out what's happening to him, I'm taking the Evo out. And we're going to drive like madmen. See how many points we can rack up on this license. Oh, AI, what are you doing, you fucking... Jesus Christ, man. AI. Fucking love and hate them at the same time. go down Grove Street. For a four-wheel drive car, this does donuts really well. Fair play, that was a cop horn. No, 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 don't flip round, don't flip round, don't flip round. No. <laughs> Lol. That worked. That's how you lose the cops. I'm back. Ooh, what happened? What happened? What happened? They're talking CEI. <laughs> uh, Do they know you were involved in the robbery? Yes. <laughs> uh, and are you going down for it? Yeah. Huh. Well, I'm at a set of lights now with a cop behind me with his lights on, so... That's good. Do, how do long you have the mic? <laughs> how long are you in jail for? I don't know, I'm not in jail yet, but they're talking. Ah, uh, that's gonna be fun for you. <laughs> you got caught. Unlucky, buddy. They're saying I question why I was detained. I asked for the reason, just because I was unsure. I've got two cops behind me. Oh fuck. Did you violate any speed rules? I don't know. Ah well, I'm gonna mute up now. <laughs> I got one straight past. Or is he blocking the... I think he's blocking the thing. Guaranteed he's going to come down in front of me now. God, that rain's loud. No? Where did he go? <laughs> uh, I'm bust a nut, right? Yep, bust a nut. Classic, bust a nut. Hey, sir. Hey, can I help you? Yeah, if you'd uh, hand me your license and registration, please. What for? Because my uh, radar, clock, radar clock to going uh, 63, back on Grove Street there, and uh, you were driving a bit recklessly and honking as well. Nah, I weren't going 63. This car doesn't even do 63. <laughs> well, that's what the radar said. Yeah, your radar's lying. It must have clocked the dude in front of you or something. Well, either way, just show me your license and registration. Uh, registration, please. Sorry, it's been a long night. Okay. There you go. My name's Buster. All right. Uh, Buster nuts. Have we met before? <laughs> Wow. Ah, uh, your name comes up on the radio pretty often. 
Ah, I wouldn't be so sure about that. That doesn't sound like me. Unless they're like praising uh. me like I often help grannies cross the street, perhaps they're telling all the other cops how amazing I am. <laughs> Alright, I see. I'll be right back with you, sir. Okay. Let's not make this long night any longer, eh, officer? <laughs> this is a nice car. I do like this car. The only thing I would change about this model... the Can I use my mouse? No. Ah, uh -huh. control? No. The side of the rear wing on the real car is the same colour as the bodywork, not black. The fin itself is black, but the two side struts aren't. I'd have them yellow in real life. And also the roll cage is completely wrong. Like, you'd smack your head on that in an instant in real life. So this cop behind you might be thinking, hmm, I know that voice from somewhere. Well, this is Christian, who, if you remember a few episodes ago, we took hostage and made him rob a shop with us. Well, he was kind of willing anyway. But we had him in the trailer in Stab City with a gun to his head, so that's where you know his voice from. And then there's a charger at the end of the lane waiting for me to take off, you can tell. That I'm pretty sure is Save Ryan, but I'm not sure. There's no way for me to check. <laughs> so yeah, this is... Last time I spoke to Christian, he had a gun and he was robbing a shop. That's pretty, pretty nice bit of trivia to know. Uh, hopefully it's a warning. All right, Mr. Nut. So, uh, do you want to explain to me why we were honking back on Grove Street? Because that madman blew a stop sign in front of me and was about to go into my lane. Did you not see him, the crazy mm. motherfucker? Almost as crazy as that guy behind us who just totally hit someone in my eyes. <laughs> yeah, he uh, probably needs to get some glasses. Uh, no, but the thing is, I don't know, I, I saw that there was about to be a crash, but I, I didn't see him not stop, so I don't know. But you know what, I'm gonna trust you, even though I kind of ran out of paper after printing out your rep sheet. <laughs> yeah, um, so, they, they seem to leave off the help in the grannies cross the street bit, that would cancel out in real life, honestly. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure it would. Yeah, so the thing is though, uh, I'm still gonna be slapping you with um, 20 to 29 miles per hour over the limit, uh, which carries a um, uh, four point infraction on your license, which will raise it from zero to four, and at 12 points you will lose your license. You can't your like knock that down to say zero points verbal warning, one of them. I know how this works, well, man. I'm gonna you work with me, you. I'll work with you. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you, I mean, Okay, okay, you know what? I'll, I'll be real with you. I, I will knock it down if you're completely honest with me. I'm listening. When you were uh, driving past me there, I saw you going into the gas station. Did you do that to evade me? No, I just I went round through the uh, lane back there. I'm looking for someone. Mm -hmm. Who are you looking for? Just a friend of mine. Just see if he's he, he, yeah, English. He usually knocks around behind Grove Street. I was gonna see if he was there. If he wanted to chill for a bit, go for a pint. If I was a vegan, I just would have just floored it. That's my style. I mean, I've never run from the cops. <laughs> you do realize, like, if you would have driven two more miles per hour, you would have hit the thirty limit. The thirty limit. That's exactly why I didn't do it. So this verbal warning, yeah? <laughs> this citation, yeah? You spelt verbal warning wrong. Here, let me let me put it down on paper for you if you have troubles uh, have trouble with hearing or something. Uh, citation. Uh, let me see here. One to five over. Uh, 20 to 29 over. You said you'd knock it down. Yeah, I don't believe you. You said if I was honest, not if you believe me. I was honest, that's what I was doing. <laughs> well, I mean, there's no objective way of determining that you're completely honest. I mean, I So have you'll have to gut. take my word for it. Come on, that's unfair. And you said you'd knock it down. I'll I was honest. 
What's no, the one underneath? Like 10 to 19 over? Let's go for that one. That sounds fair. <laughs> You're very charming, but no, it's going to be 20 to 29. I could I could hit you for careless driving also, seeing as you were... Uh, you were, I mean, you almost caused an accident there, and you're driving. I saw you kind of skidding in the uh, cul-de-sac over there, also. No, but I was looking for my I'm buddy. Be nice and not put that down for you. Well, so, I, all I was doing is looking for my uh, buddy. The client's gonna land you. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's still gonna, it's still gonna be three thousand dollars. What about fifty bucks? Fifty bucks sounds fair to me. Uh, fifty bucks plus twenty nine fifty lands you at oh three thousand dollars. There you go. If you just sign at the bottom, sir, it's not an admission to guilt. Just proving that you read and understand, and you can fight it in court. You have thirty days to pay. You sure that's not meant to be three hundred dollars? Like the knock. Gonna... I heard an officer say before you meant knock a zero off. I'm not sure if that's accurate. Yeah, actually, actually, I spoke to the police chief about that, and uh, he informed me that the uh, numbers are uh, are correct in our system right now. So, uh, what I'm reading off my little tablet here uh, is is actually correct. But you could uh, you could make a complaint to uh, to our police chief Dave uh, and ask him if that's correct. But the information I got, at least, is that it's now correct in our system. And you sure you don't want to knock that down? Maybe like five over. Uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, sir. It's it's already on paper. It's going down like this. You're in luck. I have tip X. <laughs> well, sorry, sir. You're gonna have to. Yeah, you're gonna have to sign it, or I'm gonna have to arrest you. Yeah, That's signed just it. How it's gonna be? There you go. All right. We're Thank keeping you the pen, though. <laughs> no, you're not. Give it back. Give give what back? Give my pen back. Sorry, I I, I can't hear you. the windows. Have a nice day, officer. Hey hey hey! <laughs> <laughs> you see you see that car up there? He's gonna pull up in front of you if you try to run away. Give me back my pen, damn it! You guys are so hard. Let me rephrase that. You're annoying. Well, I gotta pay for myself. The department's not paying for my pen. And I've gotta pay for the ticket you told me you'd knock down. This pen's yeah, retribution. Your own fault. You told me you'd knock That's it down. That's your fault. You went over the limit, and you kind of, you know, admitted that you didn't really care. You knew, you knew that you weren't going 30 over the limit. So that was sarcasm. Give me my pen, and we're square. Ah, uh, here you go. Yeah. Well, thank you very much, Buster. Drive safe. I don't want to catch you again, okay? Can't hear you. The window's up. <laughs> there you go, sir. I was just fucking with the uh, cops. Uh, was it Mike Ock? See, this seems to be kind of watching. Mike Okazichi. Write it for me. <laughs> I can't spell it. What, are you telling the cops this? Yes. Just say Mike Okazichi. Right on red, motherfuckers. Shit. What? Fuck. I just got caught doing donuts by this cop. The same cop that pulled me over. Okay. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Is he gonna find the button? Ah, uh, fuck. I'll pull over when I feel like it. Right. <laughs> oh, this has actually entertaining me a lot. <laughs> I'm gonna lose my license. I'm, I'm sure of it. It's the same fucking cop as Christian.
Really, man? Hey, I was looking I for was my friend. I my vehicle and I see... Yeah, looking for a friend doing uh, doing skids in the cul-de-sac. Skids? This is a four-wheel drive, man. If you ever tried to skid one of these, it's not very easy. Well, I mean, if it's not easy, then you probably have a lot of experience, because you were doing... I, I saw you doing at least, like, three or four uh, I was, donuts I, or whatever. I was driving in a circle, looking for my friend. He lives around there. His name's Steve. He's a skater. He likes skating. He also likes marijuana. But I didn't tell you that, obviously. Well, I mean, it's legal in the, in the right limit. Yeah, and it's also legal to drive in a circle. Well, not the way you were doing it, sir. Well, I mean, I was turning the wheel and driving in a circle. I saw the, the tire smoke. From, no, like, that was that was been, spray like, coming yards. up from out of the uh, out of the wheel well. You know what it's like in the rain. I saw the skid marks on the ground when I was uh, pulling around to to stop you. Yeah, other people do um, a very dangerous driving down there. It's something I would never condone doing that. What they do, you are not going to believe this. They put the full circle like I was doing, but they floor it as well, so the car spins around. I'd never do that. That's very dangerous. You could run over a small child. Alright, here's the thing, I'm gonna get back into my car, I'm gonna grab my notepad, and I'll be right back with you, okay? Okay. Are you writing me like a, um, one of those, you're an amazing driver, go help a granny across the street tickets? Verbal Might be. warning. Might be. Verbal warning. Wink. And here he comes. Alright, so I'm going to be writing you two little notes here. One's going to say that you are an amazing driver. I already knew that, bro. I appreciate it. And the other one's going to say careless driving, and it's going <clears> to <throat> give you three points in your license, which is going to land you at a total of seven points out of twelve. I thought we agreed on a verbal warning. You're not very good at this hint thing, officer. Yeah, well, I mean, you're showing quite the disrespect by doing what you did. I didn't do nothing. I was driving in a circle looking for my friend. Well, I guess it's just a matter of uh, opinion then. So you're going to have to take that for the judge. Okay. So, if you'll just be so kind to sign here at the bottom. It's going to be a $100 citation. Not that bad. There you go. <laughs> Give me back my pen, sir. What pen? <laughs> I don't know what pen you're on about. That's my pen, it's been by the, the handbrake this did. whole time. So, am I free to go, yeah? You know what? You know what? Keep it. It's my pen anyway. Thank you. <laughs> oh, wrong thing. I'm not going to put this up. It's half tempted to run that red light. <laughs> I'm enjoying myself. Nice little drift there. Shit, is that a call? That's a dodge ram. Oh no. No, don't, please. Shit. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, give me a give me a green. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love the AI in this game. I hate them, but I love them. He totally saw me run that red light. Thank 
thank god he's not biting. He saw it, but he's like, nah, I'm gonna leave that. Thank god. They're still processing fucking Fred from that robbery that literally happened two and a half hours ago, real life. <laughs> oh. I feel so evil now. <laughs> yeah, what'd you do? I, I, you, you know the cars we had? Yeah. Oh, hold on. As long as he doesn't give me up. Ooh, that's got... So, uh, go on. The good news. Mm hmm. I got half my sentence. Mm hmm. Bad news. You gave Matthew up? I gave Matthew up. And you know this car we were driving? Mm hmm. I might have said that he owned both of them, or at least stole both of them. <laughs> <laughs> you should have been like, nah, he stole both of them and I used one of them. <laughs> no, I said that he. he he was the one who got the everything. I only did as he told me to. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> so he's now wanted. Yup. I've just been driving around like a dick and stealing cops' pens. <laughs> you still in jail? Passing. Yeah, I'm still in jail. Two forty seconds left. <laughs> I just blew that light. Yeah. No, I, uh... I think I was nice. Yeah, you did well. <laughs> I'm proud of you. But I, I still have to blame you for something because of, uh... You remember the motorcycle back, uh, some few days ago? Uh, uh no, no. No, 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 no. You do that and you will end up dead. <laughs> Uh, so, no, I'm not going to blame you for that. So you've already told, said that I did it. <laughs> I'm just going to take some revenge at the point in the future. Oh, yeah. You, you take revenge, I'll take revenge with us, trust me. We, uh... Well, we seem to have uh, a uh, predicament. I think call it quits here would be the best for both of us. Take this one. No, nope, squeeze the gap. Oh shit. Yeah. That would have hurt. A lot. <laughs> My car flipped end over end. Ah, oh, shite, sir. San Andreas 911, what is your emergency? Yeah, I flipped my car over and like I hurt my head, so like can I have an ambulance? Okay, so where are you at? Uh, I'm at like 500 on Picture Perfect Drive. I, d I don't need cops or anything, I'm just I just need like an ambulance to check my head out. Okay, sir, and what kind of vehicle is it? A yellow rally car. Okay, you, are you blocking the roadway? No, nah, it's like on the sidewalk. It's sticking into the road a bit, but it's not It's not blocking the road. Okay, so I'll get some EMS sent out to you. Alright, thank you. So yeah, I flipped my car. Got a head injury, waiting for the cops. Well, EMS, sorry. I guarantee they're going to send the cop car out, though. Oh, thank God I had a roll cage. So yeah, I hit a wall that was angled up into the air, and it just sent my car flipping end over end. And I hit my head on the roll cage. So that was fun. Ah. Shit, I put my joint out back accident. Slap, I forgot that moving does that. There you go. Lean against my car, have a joint. That's how you do it. <laughs> that was, uh, fun. You're out of jail now. Yeah. I would come pick you up, but my car's bent. <laughs> uh, I am with the yeah, yellow deck, so... And it's just a quick walk up. Or oh, just steal a car from the car park, it's up to you. Uh, I'm already at yellow deck, so... In fact, I could call Toe out. I didn't think about that. Yeah. Um, right, foam. OK. 
mechanic. Can I have a tow at 500? Let's see who turns up first, an ambulance, a cop, or a tow truck driver. <laughs> uh, <laughs> That's not something I'd want to find out in real life. <laughs> Help, I've been shot, there's a burger in my house and my car's damaged. And the tow truck just turns up first. Oh. Can you have a tow at 500 picture, uh, perfect drive for a wrecked vehicle? Do you oh, that's sweet. You got that. <laughs> that's me. That's great. Yep. I think there's a cop on the way. I can hear a uh, police horn or an ambulance horn. Oh! Oh, here's a cop. Hey man, you okay? Yeah, I'm okay man. I asked for a uh, ambulance, not a cop, but okay. Yeah, well it's an accident scene, so we, we get dispatched out here as well. Uh, just for, for safety reasons, right? Yeah, that's fair enough. Yeah, it's just my head's bleeding. You gotta leave. Kiss your head, alright. Why don't you have a seat, man? I don't want you losing your balance in case you, uh, you might faint or something. So why don't you just have a seat over there, we'll get an ambulance on the way and we'll get you checked out, alright? Okay. Oh, what do you want? Oh, I saw you doing code 3, so I want to make sure everything is alright. You're gonna need me. Yeah, I just got... So I just, yeah. yeah. You're good, you can, you can chill if you want. No, I, w I was running code just because a vehicle flipped, and I uh, want to make sure he was okay. <laughs> All right, man. What's what's your name? Uh, Buster. Buster Nut. Buster. Bust. Buster Nut. Yeah. My parents were cruel to me. Anyways, um, so what happened, man? I was going along the road over that the brow of the hill right there. Obviously, doing the speed limit like thirty miles an hour, and. There was a, a maniac in the middle of the road, so I swerved to avoid him. It's like, sort of glanced the hill, my right side of the car lifted up, and then when I got traction again, I was heading straight towards that wall up there. And it's angled, so it was like a ramp, and it just flipped about three times, end over end. I was definitely doing the speed limit. Okay. <laughs> okay. No, I never seen you do Have you, uh,. Getting a bit of an odor here. Uh, you, you weren't you weren't smoking any drugs or anything. Or you didn't were drinking anything, are you? Nah, not while driving. I'd never do such a thing. That's preposterous. Okay. Okay. All right. So, w w where does it hurt me? You got a head injury there? Yeah, I just the, the left side of my head hit the roll bar. Other than that, it's fine. These cars okay. are built tough. Okay. You feeling dizzy, nauseous? Anything like that? Tunnel vision or anything like that? Uh, it was a bit earlier, like seeing double, but it started to subside now. That's, that's why I okay. asked for an ambulance. Yeah, for sure. I'll just make sure that one's getting dispatched out here. In the yeah. meantime, man, just just keep your head still. Um, I don't, you know, with a head injury, it's you just got to be cautious. So keep your head still. Just take nice, slow, deep breaths and just try and you know, slow your heart rate there. Yeah, and, uh, I, I did have a work. sip of water out of my car, and that seemed to help okay. a little bit. I got water in my car. Do you want you want a water? Nah, I got one. That's fine. Thanks. Okay. All right. Okay. I did call a tow truck as well. <laughs> Anything sus? Uh, empty baggy of. We in center console. Actually, no, in foot. Well, I'm trying to put my flashlight around, got a little baggy, it's got just like a little bit of crumbles on the, looks to be like marijuana, so green. 
Heads up. Get some, get some. Okay. Come over here. I don't want <laughs> yeah, you down on the right. sidewalk. Yeah, no. Oh. Yeah, a little bit like, like in the footwell, like, you know, like the pedals are, and it's like a little bit. Like, yeah. It's empty now, but you can see little, like, little cream crumbles. Okay. Yes, sir. Go on. Uh, you bring a flyer with you? <laughs> Best in that. Buster Nut has quite the record, I'll just warn you in advance. Eh, it's not as bad as I first thought, actually. Oh, it's it's still loading. <laughs> I just saw Murder there. Yeah, he said he was flying around, or how flying, he said he was driving the speed limit, he was definitely driving the speed limit down that <laughs> hill. Um, and then it's, uh, he swerved to avoid the, another car. Um, tended Murder, Tended Murder, um, DUI. You know, three times, he said. Which I find, kind of find hard to believe at 30 miles an hour. Abuse of a corpse times, and murder. But, you know, stranger things have happened. <laughs> okay, I've got three murder charges. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I'm on uh, the scene. The character I gave them has three murder charges. <laughs> oh no. So, um... That's going to be an interesting one for them to I run. When I rolled up, he was smoking a joint, I'm pretty sure. I saw him toss it. <laughs> I can smell it. Yeah, yeah, that's totally what I do if I just got into an accident. And I had, you know, public safety officials on the way. Well, he specifically called for no cops, so... It's definitely not yeah, suspicious gonna... at all, is it? Yeah, seriously. <laughs> <laughs> just wondering if they would click well, on that. Well, I mean... <laughs> are you date certified? I'm not. I'm not, actually. Okay, I'll see if we can get a date down here. To Drug, alcohol... Date, I can't yeah, remember what I mean. Hey, hey, Christian. Hey, Christian. Hey, Christian. Are you, uh, are you, are you date, are you date certified? Alright. Uh, because I think two parts I'm gonna ask you to do some sobriety on him. Because I did find a little baggie that, uh, there were crumbles of weed in the footwell, and, uh, and, uh, the officer said he was, uh, had a little bit of an odor on him. <laughs> yeah, just yeah, just pull off again, man. I didn't know you were date certified. <laughs> it's crazy. I feel like we're fucking with all day. All right, Mister uh, Mister Nut. Yeah. Uh, EMS is gonna be looking at you right now. They're, they're gonna take good care of you. Awesome. I, I think the bleeding stopped now. Okay. Yeah, they're just gonna take care of you. Um, and then we're gonna we're gonna have another officer here come talk to you, okay? Pretty quickly. Yeah, that's that's fine. What's what's that about? Uh, we're just we we have to just investigate the crash here. So he's just gonna ask you some questions. Something. Okay, I was definitely doing the speed limit. <laughs> no? Okay. Oh, the game froze. I'll just stay here while the EMS treat it. Yeah. I'm probably just gonna bandage it or something. And gauze? G-U-A-Z-E? To wound... Um... Oh, well, there goes my car. Subject cleared for question. That sounds about right. Uh, EMS applies bandage and goes to wounds, vitals normal, subject cleared for questioning. Hey, sorry, I was going to show 734 their uh, magic trick and it kind of, I don't know, I kind of overpowered. Oh, did you, uh, did you show the, the magic trick where you get the, you move all the other traffic along, that one? No, no, actually, I was just going to show them, uh, you know, a, a regular card trick, but I guess, uh, I guess, I don't know, your card disappeared instead of the card I was holding. Ah, <laughs> uh, you know, I saw it disappear, so, wait, you guys, that wasn't you guys, right? To, I'm, I need to get this cleared up, so I just want to make sure you didn't, that wasn't me. No, I, no, it wasn't me. But. Okay, just making sure. 
Dude, that was a yeah. sick track. I'm just gonna pray to the, the powers above if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah. That was dope, man, making that car disappear. Sorry, what? That was dope, making the car disappear. Can you make mine disappear, like Thank back you. to my garage or something? Fix it magically? I, I don't know how I feel. I'm kind of tired. It was kind of exhausting to make it disappear. Uh, I got a magic trick for you. Earlier oh, really? on, you had a pen in your pocket. I used it as a sign of thing and gave it back to you. It's now in my center console. Magic. Whoa, really? I was wondering where the pen get went. This is magic, it really is. Yeah, crazy. Well, I mean, look at it this way. Now you always have a pen ready for, uh, for your citations. Yeah, that's... I mean, no, I d I'm not getting any more citations. I've been good. Alright, Buster. If you just wanna come back with me here to my car, because we need to record this. Okay, is that dude here to tell my shit? I called him earlier. Yeah, I believe so. Oh no. Oh shit, you God know what? Damn. My stomach is just killing me right now. I think I have to head back to the station. Yeah, I'm gonna um, just quickly get my ta car towed and chill here for a bit. Alright, um. But. If you go back to the station and feel better and then come back and meet me in about 10 minutes. Yeah, sounds good. Awesome, I'll be All here. Right. So we had a server restart. I'm back at Seed now, just waiting for the cops to come back. That's um, just something that happens, and it happened at an unfortunate time. And while I'm waiting for them to arrive on scene, I'll explain something to you guys real quick. So, my OCRP videos recently have been following on from each other a lot more, like more story based. The reason for that is because I record them all in one night, I don't jump on, do a scenario and jump off again. And it's because OCRP is a life server, not a scenario server like other communities like BCIRP. So, we live as the same character, we live our life as if it was normal real life. So I'll get a character, I'll do something, and then something crazy will happen, I'll end the video, start a new one, and then we could get questioned by a cop, hey, wasn't you the guy who did that earlier? And that's why that happens, it's because it's a life RP. It's not, hey, I'm gonna do this crazy stuff. Like, I still do that a little bit, but on the whole, this is a life server now, so that is why that happens. So I'm gonna wait on scene now for Ryan and Christian and Jake, I believe it was. And then we'll continue where we left off. Obviously my car's not here. I gave the tow guy after I ended the recording a minute ago a few hundred bucks to tow my car. And just treat that like the car got towed as we are on scene. So we're trying our best to make it, the continuity of it, fit. But there will be gaps like that, so that's why that's happened. I can hear a cop now, so I've been bandaged up, all good and proper. I was smoking spliff, but after I crashed the car, and I'm still going to enforce that I was doing the speed limit. That was a taco truck wheel spinning, I think. Or was that the muscle car? I'm pretty sure the second one's on its way now. Ben. Hey. Right, I feel, do you feel better now? I certainly do. Yeah, that burrito just killed me, so sorry about that. Yeah, no problem, man. Alright, I'm just gonna talk to my colleague real quick. Okay, no worries. Alright, so, uh, we're just gonna do a field sobriety test here. Uh, we can start, if you just come over here so we get you on camera. Yeah, can I ask you a real question real quick? What's the point in that yeah, yield sure. sign right there? That seems pretty pointless to me. Could be for well, the hidden driveway, sir. Yeah. That seems excessive. I assume there's been accidents here before, so I guess they put it up for a reason. No, fair enough. I was just curious. It seems like an old place. Alright, so first off, I'm just gonna pick up my DUI pen here. I'm gonna be flashing in your eyes. Just uh, take take off your sunglasses for me here. For real. Yeah. For a moment. Uh, glasses, glasses. 
Oh, sorry. I had like nine pairs on and I got a muscle twitch. <laughs> yeah, no worries. It happens. God, my character looks weird. Alright. <laughs> 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 oh, that was funny, sorry. My character's eyes are fucking weird. Oh, look, do I? Alright, just look into the lights. Uh, borderline pass. As you know, I'm gonna do pupils dilated. Uh, lot. Alright. Uh, I'm just gonna ask you straight up did you smoke and drive? No, I, I, I'll admit, I had like, as I was waiting for the ambulance, I, was, I had like half a joint. I wouldn't smoke and drive, that's reckless. I, the only reason I had it there is because I knew I wasn't going to be driving. Well, I mean, considering you've been in an accident as well, and we can't determine uh, how that accident happened, I mean, we just have your side of the story. Uh, do you have any evidence that supports your claims that you were not uh, intoxicated while driving? Um, not really. But then there's no evidence to say I was intoxicated in driving. Well, I mean, fair point, but at the end, I mean, there was no other car here. There was no, no signs of any damage to another car, like a fallen off bumper or anything like that. Yeah, I, I didn't hit a car, I hit that wall up. up there, and I was doing the speed limit. Oh, okay. And, like, I hit the wall up there, and the car flipped end over end, like, three times. It was, like, sky ground, sky ground, and then, like, a massive bang. And I was doing the speed limit, and then the car stopped, and I felt dizzy, so I got out, had a bit of my water, and lit, lit up, like, half a spliff I had. Okay, and you were saying it was half a spliff, so uh, where was the other half? When did you have that? Uh, yesterday, I think. I don't know, I don't smoke a lot, I just... When I'm stressed, I do it to chill out a bit. It really helps, you should try it, man. Okay, so did you smoke uh, prior to uh, prior to the accident, like earlier today in the morning, perhaps? Nah, last last bit I had was like last night at like ten o'clock. I I didn't okay. feel like I was like under the influence when I was driving, like. <laughs> All right. Uh, well, I mean, considering you admitted to. Uh to smoking, I'm, I'm not going to continue with the other tests, but still, I would have to talk with my colleague here and come to a conclusion about what we're going to do. Oh, I, sorry, I, hey. I keep doing that. I think it's a side effect. Alright, Buster, that's going to be the last time I'm going to let that slide, just for your information. Yeah, I'd never normally do that. I get muscle spasms. Alright. Hey, uh... Yeah. <laughs> Why? Uh, so, uh, can we just talk over by your car for, uh, for a quick second? <laughs> what second. it is, I've got quick triggers on the bottom of my controller. It's like a, not a standard controller. And when I put it down on my leg, I punch people. <laughs> no, I'm totally going to chill up against the wall here. Alright, Buster. So, word of advice. If you do get into an accident, do not smoke up, even if you're stressed, because it's very hard for us to determine whether uh, you were uh, intoxicated while driving or not. And another cop might see it that way and uh, arrest you for it. And you'll have to explain it to a judge. So I would just assume, or uh, I would just advise you to not do it, but I'm, neither me or my colleague here are going to take you down for that. Okay, I appreciate that. Yeah, no problem. And from my end, at least, you're, you're free to go. Um, 
Do you have anything to say? No, all good. I think uh, just just watch the speeds, man. Um, seems pretty likely that I think you're probably likely going over the speed limit there. Can't I was definitely it. doing the speed limit. Be careful, man. Okay, well, just be careful driving. Don't smoke up before you drive because, like, your car is completely totaled now. And yeah, that could have been a lot worse. Can I, can I have a lift to like Burger Shop on Vinewood? I'll buy you fries, free fries, and pizza and donuts, and it's on me. Uh, you, don't, you don't have to to buy anything. I, I can take you there. Ah, uh, free fries for you, my friend. Nah, I I feel uncomfortable with accepting gifts. Chicken, then you can't turn that chicken. Ah, uh, no, I'll give you a lift, but I won't be accepting any gifts. But thank you, though. Okay, let's go. Yeah, All right, free chicken. Yeah, thank you, man. Do you want some chicken, officer? Follow us there. I'll buy you chicken. No, I'm good. I'm trying to watch my weight, man. <laughs> I can't. I can't be eating chicken. Okay, the, the offer still stands if you follow us. <laughs> Appreciate it. I'm gonna. To burger shot we go. Could you uh, point me in the direction there and just tell me where to? Yeah, where to turn? sure. <laughs> Sorry, I was on the radio. What was that? Yeah, if you if you just go through the drive-through, free fries, free chicken, free donuts, everything for you, my friend. Anything you want. I hear they do these wings. They're like <laughs> they're like southern fried, but from Kentucky. And it really is like mwah, it's on point. I'm really hungry. I could murder a bunch of fries. Well, I mean, you know, my uh, my stomach is kind of uneasy right now, so I don't know if I should be uh, eating more of that. Uh, I was at I was at like some uh, wings place, and uh, they had some weird uh, chicken burrito, and I don't know, it just messed me up really bad. Yeah, is that what made you feel in well earlier? Yeah, I mean, I feel sorry for the guy who has to go next uh, into that stall because it looked like, I don't know, post-apocalyptic stuff uh, in, the, in the toilet. So. Yeah, there's the burger place. So what do you want? Chicken, fries, and a milkshake, yeah? That, that's the classic. No. No, I'm not, I'm not getting anything, man, but thank Double you. Double cheeseburger, I insist. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. Like, I, I can't. My, I, I could lose my job if I accept any gifts, so... It's not a gift, it's a token of appreciation. Hey. Yeah, well, either way, you know, I can't accept anything, <laughs> so... Just, just park the car, yeah. I'm paying. Alright, see you, man. Go on, in you come. No, no, go on. Come on. No, you gotta follow me. Burger shot. Oh. <laughs> okay, guys, that's gonna do it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, <laughs> this has been quite a fun scenario for me, and uh, I will see you next time. Peace out, guys.